Here we go again. He's watching me. There's something right there. What? Oh, nothing. See how this goes? The lights conveniently changing. See what traffic comes at me. Since I'm recording. So the shelter has water too, hot water. They normally have ice water in the cooler. It was empty and they have hot water. The same water that they that the other location gave. That's no big deal. If you have restaurants lie about the order, what's it to a shelter? I don't know what I said. I meant to say, if you have restaurants lie about ice, what's it to a shelter? And stores, convenience stores. That's nothing. Random stores that I have went to lie about ice. My phone keeps cutting off on its own. I said, it's amazing what all these people watching how these lights malfunction and change conveniently. Let's see how this goes. The car was, it stopped because my phone's up. Let's see, it can't see me, that I have on makeup. So they scan all this traffic, the lights conveniently changed. Here's the problem. I know people would say that it's not in my mind, but you, it's still the law to yield to pedestrians. And there are several cars that have done it in less than an hour. It's escalating the abuse. He just stood up, he was sitting down. Now he's looking in his bag to not get his charge. Some kind of way he's here all the time and the bus don't want to come and do people doing strange things on the bus and the bus drivers. He's coming back. That was the one digging in the trash can. He wasn't stalking because that's a felony. But he had to dig in the trash can right by me and stand around like armies full of other people. And he's conveniently here at this bus stop. In some kind of way, these bus drivers are abusive and people riding it and everyone hates my guts on it. And not exchanging numbers with me like the first bus ride. I don't know why I was at the West End trying to get numbers, you know, because someone's married. And I thought I was had my own life. And I was exchanging numbers with two men. And we both were excited. And then someone interrupted the conversation and said, let me talk to you for a second. Hold on, hold on real quick. I didn't know, I didn't know I was targeted. Cause so, clearly that's impossible. Nonetheless, though, it happened a second time. And the same thing, can let me talk to you for a minute. Now everyone hates my guts, won't give me directions, kick and do all kind of other strange things. I don't know how it's done, but it's incredible to me. I've never seen, if I would never have believed my own story. Now they are guarding the West End like Fort Knox. You think I'm joking. I think he's behind that. All those police you see, I have seen SWAT going to the West End when I wasn't recording. Not the West End, it was Deep Ellum. I was going to Deep Ellum and I saw SWAT. And then some kind of way all these businesses closed up. I go business to business and they were locked. It was like a talk. I wasn't recording then. I repeatedly experienced strange things like that. And then after I tried to report it, because it was just too amazing, you know, go to location to location, walking, and they're all closed. A couple of them closed with me in them. They blamed it on the riot for the George Floyd. They said George Floyd did it, his murder. That's why they closed down all the businesses. The businesses were afraid that rioting would start. So they closed while I was in them, some of them. He's trying to talk to someone that's not there and doing pointing again to someone that's not there. Okay, I just wanna have a normal life. I'm gonna try to do the best I can. I don't wanna repeatedly have to upload video after video, but I think it's imperative that people see my experiences.